Movistar cancels flights in and out of Bali yet again as Mount Nagam volcano continues to spill ash, leaving 2,000 Australian tourists stranded. A gigantic cloud of ash continues to spew out of Bali's Mount Nagam volcano as rapidly changing wind causes chaos for locals and tourists. Photos of the dramatic thick plume taken from a nearby village show the massive scale of the erupting mountain, which recently left 150,000 travelers stranded on the island. Jetstar and Qantas were still flying out of Bali during the day, but canceled later flights as foretasted when changes were expected to blow the ash cloud into Denpazar Airport. Jetstar canceled seven of its flights for Saturday and several more for Sunday amid growing concerns of a violent eruption. Airline flight pilots were set to review their schedules Saturday evening and early Sunday with updated information. About 2,000 Australians were still in Bali, according to Jetstar spokeswoman Kate Miller. Jetstar and Qantas have brought more than 7,000 people back from Bali over the last three days, Ms Miller told Cindy Morning Herald. Work continued for a local woman who was pictured in the foreground of the volcano carrying debris as she walked along the road. Another woman, who wore a face mask, was spotted capturing a selfie with the monstrous cloud billowing out of the mountain behind her. Breathtaking new photos come after authorities raised the volcano's alert to the highest level four on Monday. About 40,000 people have been evacuated and are living in temporary shelters as the area experiences ongoing earthquakes. Flights bound for Bali were on Saturday cancelled as an impending explosive eruption forecast by volcanologists forced airlines to shut services down. Images from the Volcanic Ash Advisory Center showed that wind would push the giant ash cloud towards Denpazar Airport Saturday afternoon and evening. An Indonesian seismic report revealed earthquake tremors around the mountain had become closer together and had increased in strength. The island's most recent powerful tremor was felt Friday night escalating the possibility of a major eruption at any moment. While less ash pouring from the top of the volcano had some believing the worst could be over, volcanologist Dr. Janine Krippner said it was normal for activity to fluctuate. This does not mean it is over. Fluctuations in activity are a normal part of the life of volcanoes, Dr. Krippner said on Twitter. One third of Mount Higgins crater has filled with magma, meaning a violent eruption remains likely. According to Indonesia's Volcanology and Geological Disaster Mitigation Center, we calculate it based on the monitoring results of Himilwari satellite images of seismic recording data, deformation and geochemistry, a spokesperson said. NASA's Earth Observatory said, the plume appears to rise from two vents in the volcano's crater.